welcome you in Pirate Nation to Grand Bay Pirate Basketball taking on the Brewer Bears. Joining me tonight, I'm Phil Bradley. Joining me, Cameron Ward. For the second time in the booth, I believe? Yes. First time, JV football. Yeah, so, you know, a little bit of a step up. JV football, varsity basketball. Interesting matchup here. Grand Bay Pirates starting the typical senior heavy. Kudo, Rucker, Colston. Trejo, but something you don't see, Dalen Webb starting yes. for... Starting over Gennaro, because he just came out of injury. Mm -hmm. Will we see any of Gennaro playing tonight? I think he'll play a little bit. He was warmed up, so he looked pretty fresh. Mm -hmm. I'm more well-educated in basketball than football. Definitely. Well, it was a fun time doing football with you. Mm -hmm. Bay Pirates have been doing pretty good so far. District played just underway. Yeah. Boyle wins the tip with it now. Looks like we're playing a mm, man defense. Kind of a zone and down low a little bit. Now we're back in the 2-3 zone. Drive inside, Brewer oh. tries to put up a shot. Yes, man. Off of Brewer, quick turnover for the Bears. Pirates will take it down now. Kensington Colson, point guard. No surprise to see him bringing the ball down for the Pirates. Three years starter. That's impressive to see. Very impressive. Isaiah's three-year starter as well, I think. And I believe Kudo's right up there with him. Mm -hmm. Yes, Marcy is a sophomore, all three of them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, not often you see one guy three-year starter, but mm -hmm. three guys, three-year starters is pretty rare. Very impressive. Ball under, great pump fake by Colston for the first two baskets, the first two points of the game. Mm -hmm. That's his area right there, down low. Very deep bag. He definitely is, you know, very experienced. Blue drives, block shot. Goes in. Quickly matched by the Bears. Pirates pushing the pace now. Brewers come out in a man defense. Jermaine, Jermaine posting up, ball's in there. Ball turned over, Bears with it now. Mm -hmm. Top of the key three. Off the front of the rim, no good. Rebound, Colston. You know, Colston, so versatile. He does a lot of different things for the Pirates. Mm -hmm. You'll see him anywhere from around the arc yep. to uh, inside the paint. Really a broad range of what he can do and not really that much of a range of what he can do. Very good player, both sides. And Isaiah Trejo, wasn't it last year he won defensive player of the district? I believe the past two years. Past two years? Co-defensive defensive player of the years. All of our players are very good, both sides of the floor. Mm -hmm. Brewer with it now, tie ball game. Working around the arc. Yep. Jumper just inside of the three-point line. That's going to be two. Yep. It seems Brewer has, they have a kid 6'8", and he's sitting on the bench right now. Yeah, you know, warm-ups were a little, I imagine, intimidating. Mm -hmm. Uh, foul called. Yeah, one of those little intimidating right there is, you know, you heard some some rim smack and some dunking, yes. maybe, maybe not, uh, from Brewer, but seems like none of the guys that were dunking are actually starting. Yeah. Kind of same situation we're in a little bit. Oh, good rebound by Dylan. Mm. Brewer with the ball. Travel called Pirate Ball. And you heard almost immediately after that travel happened, mm -hmm. Coach Brazil and the entire Pirate bench asking for it, telling the ref, hey man, that's, and uh, whistle was blown not long after. Right. A little good screen right there by Dalen. Jermaine with the ball. Our pirate offense mainly consists of back screens, flare screens, not many ball screens. Ball screens are rare. Yeah. We're yeah. always trying to get that other guy open. A lot of movement uh, without the ball for the Pirates. Yep. Oh, missed rebound. Brewer's ball. Missed three right there by Dalen Webb. And I think one of the big things for the Pirates right now, you mentioned the 6'8 kid on the bench. Mm -hmm. Rebounding is going to be a big part of tonight. Yeah. We've seen Dylan Kudo get his hands on a few balls so far, but 
not really able to come down with him. Oh, so make sure you box out. Mm -hmm. Little floater. Sinks. Two more points for the Bears. That'll make it 6-2. No scoring since Colston got the first two points of the game. Yeah. Illegal screen. You don't see that really very much. No, you don't. Mm -hmm. Especially Jermaine caught the ball right after the illegal screen. Yeah. It's kind of hard to see the Brewer jerseys numbers. It really is. They're a little small. They kind of blend in. Mm -hmm. Oh, Kinsington missed steal. Went for the steal. Help defense. No good. That's another two points. Everything seems to be knocking down the board right now. Well, the Pirates are known for, you know, kind of a slow start. And once we start getting the pace, especially in the third quarter, that's when everything starts getting closer. You know, yeah, you know, right now the Pirates are putting up about the same amount of contested shots as the Bears. Mm -hmm. Just Brewers seem to be falling a little bit more often. Yeah. Deep three here. Off the back of the rim, no good. Rebound, Kudo. Richard Brazil, very vocal right now, early in the game. Good pass he by Taylor. He typically Taylor. is. Oh. oh. Reverse, no good by Colston. That was a great pass by Dalen Webb. It really was. Mm -hmm. Three minutes left to play here in the first quarter. Grand Bay trailing by six. Brewer drives, left handed layup, no good. good. Kins with the rebound, pass to the Kudo. Euro set, and it's good. That's a good move right there. Great move by the big man, Dylan Kudo, right there. Not something you see often. Yeah. Brewer will drive, spin move, pump fake, goes up with it. Defense, Colston. Good defense by Kinsick and Colston. Good spin, reverse pass. Put it with the rebound, and he makes it. Making a little comeback right here. Two minutes left. Kudo grabbed his own miss right there and put it right back up. Great pass by Kinsick and Colston. Mm -hmm. Kinsick's very good um, at passing. It's one of his key characteristics. Passing. And he's very deep bag he scored in that in any position. Mm -hmm. Definitely, you know, once you see him kind of drive to the lane, he's got so many options of how to get rid of the ball or get a shot up. Mm -hmm. I really don't know what's gonna happen. Yeah. Brewer here holding the ball, kind of wasting some time. Slowing it down. Tired Mitchell with it. He'll make a move. Trejo, Trejo defending. Oh, uh, Off-hand reverse layup foul. Foul on 33, Jermaine Rucker. Rucker's going to pick up his second foul of the quarter and head to the bench as Murphy Page checks in. This is where Granberry could use that height advantage from mm -hmm. Page, you know? Murphy's our tallest player. He is, and we've seen him on the bench a little bit against some of these tall teams that you would expect. Maybe Coach Brazil looking at it a different way tonight. Well, little baseline drive, three-pointer. Dylan with the rebound. Murphy with the ball. Little post move. Oh, Brewer with the board. Under a minute left to play here. Mm -hmm. We're still holding the ball. It's very strange seeing it at the beginning of the first quarter. Not, not really uh, expecting them to slow down the ball here at the end of the quarter. They were moving with a fast pace and had a six-point lead at this point, now cutting down to two. I feel like this will be a very low-scoring game. Definitely very a defensive heavy game. Uh, Pirates have seen some moments where their defense has gone subpar. Mm -hmm. Brewer setting up a play now. Less than 10 seconds left. Murphy on the ball. 
Good defense by Murphy. One second left. That's the end of the first quarter. Kudo throws one up. Has to have court nowhere near close, but that will do it. Granberry trailing six to eight. We will be right back. Coming out of the timeout here, we want to give a shout out to our sponsor, First National Bank, for everything they do for us here at Pi Sports Network, along with Henson's Lumber for sponsoring Pi Sports Network. Couldn't do what we do without them, nope. and definitely grateful for them. Pirates will start with the ball here, second quarter. Kudo has it, right wing. Pass. Has stolen. Murphy has it. Very contested lay by Murphy. Very contested lay of. Page fights through the contact to add two more points. This is a tie game mm -hmm. quickly into the second quarter. Yep. Greer with it now. Mitchell drives left handed. Page got it all oh. over. Ray is in the game now. Drive baseline. Page goes up defense. Oh. Greer answers back with a quick two points. Hart's moving a little quicker off the inbound now. Isaiah with the ball. Pull up jumper. Rolls in. Trail a little hesitant to pull it right there. Don't know why. Took one bouncing right in. Yep. Elbow jumper, no good. Rebound, Colston. Pass it. Gennaro drops somebody and misses it. Kudo with the putback. You can always count on Kudo getting those missed shots. Kudo having a great night on the boards right now. A little overmatched on height, but does not stop him. Brewer is going to call timeout. Granberry leads for the first time since the very first points, 12 to 10. We will take a quick break up here. We come out of this timeout. Granberry leading by two, 12 to 10. 6.30 left to play here in the second quarter. Granberry, four quick points. Number five, Miller Shinnewark, and number 32, Halston Main subbed in. Trejo and Kudo taking some time off the bench. Kudo picked up another two points right before the timeout. Murphy Page with the rebound. That's it to Miller Shinnewark. Kicked out three. With three corner. No good. Murphy with the rebound. The bank shot. You know, that's about the only shot Murphy can really do outside of five feet of the rim. But, you know, if it works, it works. Definitely his fourth point of the night. Mm -hmm. Shouldn't work. Three almost went in right there. Almost. In and out. Mm -hmm. Page was there to clean it up. Yeah. Brewer with it now. Trailing four. Lob pass. And he misses. 
Murphy with a tough rebound. Looks like the Pirates are running more of a man defense now. Gennaro with a man layup. Good to see, uh, see Gennaro Reyes back in the game and scoring for the Pirates. Yeah. I think he took about a two week vacation. Yeah, about however that. However long mm -hmm. with the injury. I think it's his first game back since the break. Yeah, definitely a long time without him playing mm -hmm. for Pirates. Yeah. Three for Brewer. Sinks in. Sixteen thirteen with five minutes left. Granberry's up. Reyes loses it, picked up by Shinawart. Baseline kick. Halston oh. Main. Miller and Halston both go for that bounce ball. Brewers ball. Now returning to the game for the Pirates, number 23, Dylan Kudo. And number three, Jalen Webb. Burr ball looks like the Pirates coming out in a full court press. Webb and Kudo back in. Colston taking a second on the bench. Not something you see very often here from the Pirates. Mm -hmm. Mitchell will drive and draw contact off of Dalen Webb. His shot is good, headed to the line for a chance for a three-point play. Yep. Free throw rolls in. Burr is tied now with Granberry, 16-16. Kick inside, pass stolen, Brewer. Help defense, Mitchell in the paint, loses it, pick up. Steal. Two on one. Oh, very contested layup by Gennaro. Barely misses. Corner three. Took a few too many steps before he got the shot up. Now returning to the game, number 10, Kensington Colston. And number four, Isaiah Trejo. Colston and Trejo check in. Mm -hmm. Shinawark and Paige will take a break. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, Jaren Reyes, you really don't see him miss that many layups under mm -hmm. the basket. Even when they are contested, he finds a way to put them in. Just that one is a little too far for him. Yeah. Colston steps through, rolls around the rim. Foul on 23, Dylan Kudo. Um, Brewer taking it up. Mitchell with it, spin move. Kinsman fighting for the rebound. Jump ball. A little back talk to the ref from Brewer right here. Lombardo, number five for Brewer. Not really happy with Colston right there. Mm -hmm. Holston's just fighting for the ball. Yeah. Webb checks back in here. Oh, Thomason, excuse me. We'll check in. Trejo ends up on the ground. No whistle blown. Three, no good. Rebound, Brewer. Second yeah. chance is. No second oh. chance points. That's what gets us. Playing tight defense. Dalen mm -hmm. Webb. Push. 
Well, it's right off the rim. Granberry has not grabbed a rebound in a concerning amount of time. Spin move, fade away, no good. Rebound, Colston. Colston's on top of those boards. Dylan Kudo with the leg. Great, great pass by Colston. Kudo's fourth bucket of the night, and a lot of that has come off the hands of Kensington Colston. High game, 18-18, two minutes left. High field rebound, Isaiah with the board. Granberry moving the pace, four on two here. Inside Kudo. Good save by Kudo. Three pointer by Dalen Webb. 21-18 Pirates. Mitchell with it now for Brewer, slowing the pace down. Mm -hmm. Granberry switch defense. Jumper no good, that's gonna be a foul call. Rightfully so, Lombardo came all the way around Dalen Webb right there. Good board by Trejo. Miller Stenor being subbed back in for Peyton Thomas. Just under a minute, 30 left to play here in the second quarter. Mm -hmm. Oh. A little miscommunication on the play right there. Ball goes out of bounds. Looked like Shinawak thought Colston was going to keep going. Mm -hmm. Colston took a stop and the ball really was already headed there. Yeah. Mark on defense. Switches it now. Mm -hmm. Looks like the Pirates may be back into that 2 3 zone. Pass under. Great defense right there by Shinawark. Rebound, Kudo. Over Kudo. Kinson with the ball. Got a man behind him. Whistle blown. Foul call is going to go on Colston. Offensive call. I guess there was a little push off right there on that drive. Colston not happy with the call. Granberry hanging on to a three point lead, about 30 seconds left here to play. Doing the same thing they did in the first quarter, just holding the ball, wasting time. Ten seconds left here. Brewers finally starting to make a move. They want the last shot. Oh, Miller almost the seal. I Kensington with the seal. Lose to the out of bounds. Two seconds left on the clock. Holston not happy. A lot of contact on him as he's trying to go for the ball. Mm -hmm. the ref's not seeing it. Returning for the Pirates, number 30, Murphy Page. Page gonna make a two-second substitution here for Trejo. Yep. Could be looking at a attempted pass in the pants while we put him in. Mm -hmm. Whatever Brewer does, they're gonna have to do it fast. Half court shot is no good. Over two on those in the game. Granberry heads into halftime, leading by three, 21 to 18. Once again, I'm Cole Bradley. Joining me, Cameron Ward. We will be right back after the halftime.
We welcome you back out of the half. Granberry leading 21-18. We're going to take a quick short minute to say thank you to our sponsors, First National Bank and Henson's Lumber for everything they do for us. Pass quickly intercepted. Shinwark fighting for it. He won't get it back. Looks like that play right there, they gave it to Murphy and Miller was supposed to cut, but the pass was a little either early or late because it got intercepted. Inside move, trying to fight off Kudo. Kudo, great defense. Shot it from behind the backboard. Yeah, it hit the glass, just not the right side of it. Mm -hmm. Not something you see very often. Yeah. Uh, pretty good defense by Dylan Kudo right there. Mm -hmm. Webb with it now. Inside, Dylan. Kudo. Oh. In and out of the rim. Shot no good. Mitchell with it now. Right side, baseline drive, inside, pass tip, stolen. Miller with steal. Oh. Misses a layup. I just thought he was going to dunk that right there. I did too. He got up there like he definitely could have. Mm -hmm. Shinwark went at it again. Didn't get it. King with it now. Hands off to Mitchell. Mm -hmm. Miller's the only sophomore in varsity. He is. Well, Page, well, also the only junior on yeah, varsity. Only two underclassmen. Not something you see very often. Mm -hmm. Next year, the full team is going to be different. A lot of contact there on Colston. No whistle blown. He got hit hard, lost the ball. Mitchell with it now. Kudo guarding, drive to the line. Kudo not happy with the foul call. Especially after the contact on uh, Kenzie and Colston right there. No whistle was blown. Foul on 23, Dylan Kudo. Throw is good. Tie game. 21 21. Kudo with it up top. Hand off back to Colston. He's doing with a pump fake. Building with the ball. Granberry looking for an open shot. Colston drives the lane, loses it. Ball staying Granbury side. Oh. Looks like a ref challenge. One ref originally said Gran uh, Granbury ball, mm -hmm. overturned by the far ref to make it Brewer ball. Kind of weird because he's further away than the guy that's closer. Yeah, definitely uh, interesting right there. But Referee said he had a better angle at it. Mitchell with it now. Trejo checks in for Shinawart. Mitchell will drive. Oh. Wide open lane and his layup is good. That was some bad defense right there for the Pirates. Webb picks up his dribble early. Gets it out to Colston. Colston with it now. Granberry looking for something to help them get this quarter started. Three minutes underway here. And finally, whistle is blown. I think they called a block. Wow, number one, one two. Hard ball. Rucker in the game now. Jermaine in the paint. Layup. Good. That ties the game. That shot right there didn't even really move the net at all. Mm. That was a good play, too. I think that was the play they've been trying to run with Murphy and Miller, but this hasn't been 
has been flowing as well as with other guys. Baseline drive, corner three, no good. Rebound, Brewer. Back outside, Mitchell. Drive, spin move, fade away, no good. Rebound, tipped up in the air, brought down by Colston. A lot of contact. Lost ball, still Granberries. Colston looking for a foul call on that driver right there. Ref's been a little hesitant to give him a foul, to give him the whistle. Yeah. A little inbound play right here. Passes up top to Isaiah. Corner for Dalen. Great move by Webb, floater. A little floater. Over the top foul, I think. And I'd assume that'd be a safe guess, and that's what it's going to be. Lombardo will pick up another foul. He'll check out of the game. Mm. You know, the height difference right there is not in favor of Dylan Kudo. Mm. But that just shows you Dylan Kudo's rebounding skills right there. Yeah. So get a foul call. Jumper from Kudo, no good short. I think they call that play Purdue. I can see it. Yep. Little contested layup right there by Brewer. Timeout. Two more points for Brewer will give them the two point lead 23 25, 344 last play here in the third quarter. We will take a quick break. We welcome you back here into the third quarter. Granberry down by two, 23-25. 3.44 left to play. Once again, I'm Cole Bradley. Joining me, Cameron Ward mm -hmm. on the court for the Pirates. Kudo, Webb, Trejo, oh. Rucker. Brewer's running the press right now. Mm -hmm. Oh. Jermaine asking for the tip. Now it's turning for the Pirates. Number 24, Janeiro Reyes. Looks like it's Brewer's ball. Reyes going to make the sub after that turnover there by Webb. Reyes, I imagine on a little bit of a minute restriction, kind of trying to ease him back into the game here mm -hmm. after coming off an injury. Yeah. I believe this is his uh, first game of the year, actually. Yeah, um... Maybe, I think so. I think so too. Uh, Shot off the glass is good. Colson mm -hmm. with the ball. Little pump fake. Ball's hit out of bounds. It's a little Granberry's ball. Rucker inbounding. Dylan with a good layup inside. How many points is that for Dylan? Looks like 10. Really good game. He is, and he's having a good night under the paint as well, getting rebounds. Yeah. So is Kensington. Kensington's on top of those rebounds too. 
Yeah, not something you expect from someone his build, you know, more of a guard-like guy. Yeah. But he's definitely in the paint trying to get his rebounds. Mm -hmm. Mitchell with it, passes it off. Off the foot of Brewer, Colston with it now. Oh, loses it. Isaiah with the defense. Trejo picks him up, great defense. Corner three, wide open. Knocks it down, that's a five point oh, lead for Brewer. Good pass by Isaiah. Inside, back out, Colston three. No good, in and out of the rim. We're here trying to hold the ball again. Only a minute left in the third quarter. Mitchell drives, they're gonna get whistle Foul blown. on the floor. Foul on number four, Isaiah Trejo. Foul's gonna go on Trejo. Dalen Webb being subbed in for Jermaine Rucker. Oh, a lot of play right there. Not much you can do against that. Granberry with it, trailing by their biggest deficit of the night, seven. Under a minute left to play, Webb with it, and off to Reyes. Reyes will drive, shot, no good, rebound. Find for it. Mitchell with it, oh, pass good defense rejected. Like good contested layup right there by Colson. Great all-around play, play right there by Kenzie Colston. Steal and the layup. Yep. Mitchell loses it, but off the hands of Trejo. Playing tight defense, trying to get this ball back, prevent a last-second shot. Yep, five seconds left on the clock. That's the end of the third quarter. Granberry trailing by five, headed into the fourth quarter, 27-32. We will take a quick break and get to you soon. After the fourth quarter, Granberry. One quarter left to play here in the Granberry Pirates against the Brewer Bears. Granberry trailing by five, 
Once again, I'm Cole Bradley. Joining me, Cameron Ward. This has been a tight back and forth game all night. Mm -hmm. Yes, it has. Now, right now, Brewer is ranked second in the district. Saginaw beat Brewer, and we lost Saginaw by three. We were up the whole game at the very end. So this game, this game decides who will remain second in district. So it will help hearts a lot if we win this game. Ball tipped out. Mitchell Lobb broken up by Kudo. Dalen with a full court pass to Kensington. He makes it. Great defense right there by Colson and then turnaround to get the layup. Brewer with the ball now. Reyes defending. Off the shoe. Kickball foul. Personally, if I were to get rid of any foul in the NBA or basketball, it'd be that foul. Kickball. I like kicking the ball a lot. So. It is. It is a weird one. You know, mm -hmm. you don't really see it that often, but it's kind of weird when it gets called. Mm -hmm. Brewer inbounding. Nobody really open. Lob to Mitchell. Colston went up with it. Mitchell came down. Drive, paint, kick, corner three. No shot. Holding it. Foul on Gennaro, looks like. Foul on number 24, Gennaro Ray. Not much sign of a foul right there. Mm -hmm. Ball handler not really affected by whatever Reyes did. Mm -hmm. Another law play. Broken up by Kudo. Dylan fighting for it. Granberry ball or timeout. That's good play by the coach right there. It is. Coach Brazil quick on his feet. He's mm -hmm. still got it. Great defense on the lob. Yeah. Two times by Dylan Kudo. Granberry only trailing by three. Just under a minute underway here. We will take a quick break. Why is the timeout? We come out of the timeout. Granberry holding some momentum right now. Mm -hmm. Trailing by three. Colston, Reyes, Trejo, Kudo, and Webb on the floor for your Pirates. Isaiah with the ball. Passes to Gennaro. Right there, I think they're looking for that open three by Dalen. That's a lip. Foul on the floor. Or push. Foul number 11, J.D. Johnson. Hires ball. Sub for the Bears here. Kudo almost could have been on the shot right there. Mm -hmm. It was very close, but yeah. referee very adamant that it wasn't. Mm -hmm. Ball back out to Webb. Reyes with it now. Blocking foul on number two. Foul on number two, Tyler Mitchell. Good inbounding. Trejo loses the ball. Brewer picks it up. Mm -hmm. Granberry was trying to get a play there. Nothing really moving for the Pirates. Mm -hmm. Mitchell with it. He'll drive. A lot Ooh. of contact. Mm, kind of looks like he just tripped, but that's just me. Mm -hmm. Foul on yeah. You know, Reyes, Reyes hit him, but I don't know how he ended up on the ground. Mm -hmm. Maybe a little bit of flop. Definitely a little... Little help right there. Yeah. Mitchell will drive. Webb looking for a charge. No call on it. 
Mitchell hit Webb. Webb ended up on the ground. No whistle called, though. The charge is always a good defensive play. It is, and it looked like a charge to me. Shot up. A lot of contact on Colston. No foul call again. Colston on defense now. Brewer going to call a timeout. Colston not happy that he's not getting foul calls tonight. Timeout. Granberry now trailing by 5, 29-34. We will take a quick break as Brewer calls another timeout. Looks like they subbed Miller Shinawark in for Isaiah Trejo. Shinawark a little bit quicker than Trejo, but definitely a little height disadvantage on him. Yeah. But what Miller lacks on the height, he makes up for in his jump. Mm -hmm. That kid can bounce. Yes, he can. One, actually, you probably wouldn't guess it, probably the best dunker on this Pirates team right oh, now. Oh, yeah. Halston's up there, too. He's really good. Murphy, but, I mean, when you're 6'6", six, six, you, you've got to be a little bit good yeah. at dunking. Yeah. Five point game right now, five minutes, three seconds left. Pirates need to get something going right now if they want to win this game. In the paint, kicked right back out. Brewer just moving it around, probably burning some clock. Mitchell with it. Whistle blown, Brewer gonna call another timeout. timeout. Looks like it's been about 30 seconds since the last one, but we will head to another break as Brewer calls another timeout. Coming out of another timeout here. Brewer is still with the ball. Miller playing up. Looks like we're playing a high 2-3 zone. He's going to stick. by Colston oh, on the ground. Miller just misses it. Granberry going to have to play a little bit of risky defense here if they want to stop Brewer from just burning yeah. time. That lob play. Really good play right now from Brewer. Pirate ball. Grabbed by trainer Andy Rankin. Mm -hmm. Always count on him for helping our players when they're hurt. Always, he, Always there for us. He seems to be everywhere. I'm sure mm -hmm. Gennaro Reyes has gotten a little familiar with him in the past few weeks. Oh, yeah. Reyes with the ball. He'll drive, oh, loses it. Miller really grabs it. Three on two. Tipped again. Grande right now. Looks like they're losing the ball right before they can get a shot up. Mm -hmm. 
down by seven. Down by seven, tied for the biggest deficit of tonight. Mm -hmm. A lot of lead changes, Granberry trailing 29-36. Granberry is gonna call a timeout this time and we will take a quick break. Coming out of another timeout, Grand Bay going to have the ball this time, trailing by seven, inbounded to Colston. Colston with it, hands it off to Webb, little trouble with it, he'll recover. Has it to Shinnewark, lose it. Foul is called. Whistle blown, refs trying to figure out on the shot or in the floor. Kind of looks like a mixture of both. It's going to be on the shot. These free throws are very critical. Maybe. You know, these might actually be the Pirates' first free throws of the night. Very crazy to see a, a team's very first free throws halfway through the fourth quarter. Yeah, you know, typically you see like Kensington Colston, Dylan Kuda, all of them under the basket getting a little beat up. Yeah. But I'm not familiar if I, I can't really recall any free throws tonight so far. Mm -hmm. Shinnewark's second one is good. Let's look back to the press. 31. That's what they call this press. Very mm -hmm. trailing by six. Mitchell with it. All the way down low. Brewer won't take the shot. Four minutes left on the clock. They're going to have to burn a lot of time. Yeah. Isaiah with the defense. Let's him go by. Knocks off the backboard. Mm. Rebound Brewer in the corner. They're not looking to take a shot here. Kins has been fighting for it. In the corner, take the three this time. It's good. That'll push it to nine. Isaiah with the three-pointer. No good. Trails three, no good. Brewer looking to slow it down. Brewer with it, three minutes left to play. Miller with the tip. Mm. Wide open. Granberry defense falling apart right now. Brewer playing very spread out. Mm. Granberry really can't afford to let them slow it down right now. Mm. Kinson loses it. Fouls on the floor for Kinson. He's not getting that call. Colston finally getting some contact with us so far. Granberry going to take another timeout, trailing by 11 this time. Clock slowly dwindling down. 2.45 left to play here in the fourth quarter. We will take a quick timeout.
Coming back out of timeout here, Granberry 30, Brewer Bears 41. Trejo will be inbounding it under Granberry Basket. 2.45 left to play here in the That's fourth quarter. Dalen Webb, whoop, out of bounds. Granberry inbounding it again. Back to Webb, get out of bounds again. Trey Hill going to inbound it again. He's slowly just making his way around the out of bounds. We'll get it in this time. Bolston will get it. Ball screen by Dylan. That's the center work. Trejo drives his shot off the glass, no good. Two minutes left to play. Brewer moving it down the court fast. Kick to the corner, corner three. No good, rebound Brewer. Another timeout. Brewer calls another timeout. Grand Bay still trailing by 11. We'll take this time as they head into a timeout to hide, head into a break as well. Brewer's ball down low. Mm. Brewer trying to move it around. Shouldn't work on defense. Looks like they said Peyton Thomason. And Max McPherson as well. Mm -hmm. Oh, need to get that steal. Burr have been passing it around now for the past four minutes. Moving it around now. Baseline drive, lob, caught, shot, no good. Miss. Rebound with Kudo. And off Colston, three. He's no good. A uh, 3v1. Who passes it back up top? Less than a minute left. Granberry probably going to not make it an 11 point comeback. Never know. It's always a chance. Brewer is still moving the ball around. Well, very tough game for the Pirates right here. Definitely a close one right there. Towards the end of the third quarter, Pirates started to lose it. Brewer started passing around and burning clock about six minutes left here in the fourth quarter. Looks like they just should dribble out these last few seconds. Granberry really couldn't get around it. Huh? 
So Grand Bay loses 30 to 41. Close game. Grand Bay gonna head into another game Friday. I think against Azel. Azel. That one's gonna be away, but the Lady Pirates will be in town for that one. So if you can't make it to the gym, check into Pirate Sports Network. Once again, I'm Cole Bradley. Joining me, Cameron Ward. We will see y'all later. Have a good night.